Hey guys, let's take a look at some radar detector test results. We've got a series of detectors here that we actually ran in a course. Uh, we've got the new Uniden LRD950. Uh, we're also going to be running the MAX, the MAX2, the V1, and the Redline. We're going to be running all these detectors against a constant on Decatur Genesis 2, which is a KA35.5 uh, source. This is going to be in uh, kind of foresty terrain with some curves to uh, spice things up and give us a little bit of separation between the detectors. So let's go take a look. And so as you can see, we're definitely getting a difference between detectors uh, and also the weather plays a role in things. Uh, when it starts raining a little bit more, detection goes down. When the weather clears up, we get better performance. And so because of this, we did multiple runs to take into account things like uh, weather changes, uh, traffic potentially blocking signals, etc. And we did find uh, you know, things were pretty consistent, keeping you know, as many variables as we can equal. Uh, what we found, as you can see, is the red line was pretty much the king in terms of detection, which is what we would expect, especially on a course like this. The V1, the MAX, and the MAX2 were all kind of in the same ballpark. They would all generally alert by that uh, side pullout on the right, uh, plus or minus a couple feet, you know, plus or minus a second or so, but all right there in that range. And the unit in would be kind of at that pullout or just beyond, so it kind of rounds out the bottom of the pack. Cool, there we go. There's a look at a series of different detectors and how they fare against uh, a Genesis 2 running 35.5. Hope that's been helpful. Thanks for watching.